All right, now Google Maps have been one of the most important applications which we use in our day-to-day -day life on any Android phones or iPhones, including your Samsung Galaxy phones. This application has changed our life. It has changed the way we navigate and travel using our phones. Now this app offers some amazing useful widgets which not everybody would be aware of. So in this video, we are gonna check out all those amazing widgets associated with the Google Maps application. This video is gonna be interesting and I'm sure you you are going to start using these widgets for sure so keep watching but before we go ahead if you haven't been a subscriber on apex go ahead and hit the subscribe button to know your phone better and give this video a like if you find it useful now let me just press and hold on the home screen and tap on widgets and i'll scroll all the way down and tap on maps as you can see we have got about seven widgets over here the first one is nearby traffic let me just press and hold on this and bring it on the home screen. As you can see, this widget shows the nearby traffic conditions right here on this small window. This will be the live feed we get on this widget. We have this zoom button on the bottom right corner. We can just tap on this to zoom in or zoom out and check out the nearby traffic conditions. So this is a very useful widget which you can set on the home screen and you can also customize the size depending on your requirement. That is the first cool widget we have. Now let's again go to widgets and tap on Google Maps. The second widget is gonna help us quickly find places nearby. By default, we have got home and work location buttons and then we can easily search restaurants around us and the fuel stations around us by tapping on this button and we also have this search bar right about this. These are two basic widgets that we get on Google Maps. Now let's go ahead and check out some cool interesting widgets that we have got. We are left with five of them. These are in the size one by one and they look like any app icons. As you can see we have got one for directions, then we have got for driving mode, we have got friends location, share location and then traffic. Let's press and hold on directions. I will drag and drop this on the home screen. As soon as you drop it here, it is going to ask you to choose the destination you want to set for this particular widget. You can also select the mode of travel and then you have got a few options like avoid ferries, avoid motorways, avoid toll roads. Once you set the destination and tap on save. You can select the destination which you want. You can select the ones which you frequently travel to. The moment you tap on the icon, it is going to straight away take you to Google Maps navigation page and just start driving. As simple as that. The next widget is share location. You will be able to share your live location with your friends and family as long as you want. That's a fantastic widget we have got. As you can see, when I tap on sharing, we can select the time here. By default, it is for one hour. And if you want to increase or decrease the time, you can do that by pressing these buttons. And we also have an option until you turn this off. Just select the contact or the email ID that you want to share with, tap on done. Now I'm sharing my live location to another person. So he or she will be able to see where exactly I am by setting the same widget on the home screen. As you can see on this phone, I can see the location which has been shared from this contact right here on this phone. That is shared location widget that we have on Google Maps. The next one is traffic. This is a simple widget it's going to show you all the current traffic condition in your city. You can also select a particular destination to check out the traffic conditions. The next widget is driving. Let me just tap on this. As you can see, it's going to show me all the recently searched locations. I can directly tap on this to start driving from here. The last one is friend's location. If at all your friend is sharing his or her location from their phone, you will be able to see it by tapping on this particular widget. These are pretty useful widgets which are associated with Google Maps, which you might not have explored. So to get the best out of your Google Maps widgets, you can start using these widgets on your phone. Let me know what do you think. Have you already been using these widgets? Drop a comment. While you do that, hit the subscribe button if you haven't been a subscriber already and smash that like button if this video is useful to you. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.